Okay, I just thought I'd do some quick Shapeways uh, builds and I got them back the other day and wanted to show them off. So this is the uh, Eiffel Tower by Sarconics. It's uh, done with the uh, Glimmer Texture Pack, which sort of comes out but sort of has some problems, like you can see over here on this side, uh, that it's not really coming out quite consistently. Um, so that was an experiment. <clears throat> this is a funky little piece that um, has meaning to me and doesn't look like much to anybody else. It's basically just some crazed uh, circuitry that I have that do things like open pistons and pour water down the hill and uh, this is part of a uh, X the Unknown, uh, it's this whole roller coaster system and so on and there's tunnels underground and whatnot. Um, anyway, that's one that I like but nobody else will, it doesn't look all that pretty. So let's go to a really pretty one. This is one by, um, I honestly forget his name, but I'll put it in the uh, description of the video. Uh, it's a very cute little model. It's basically a little uh, Minecraft in a, in a bowl, as it were. It's uh, just sort of a little world of, of its own. It's just uh, this little world. It's got these beautiful trees that he's built up and uh, this water pouring the, over the edge of the bowl. So I thought that was a, a nice, cool little model. Uh, pretty cheap. I think it was like 18 bucks or something, maybe less. Um, small is cute. Smaller is cuter is cheaper. So, <laughs> and, oh, and this one I should say is uh, printed at one millimeter a block, so it gets a very nice. Uh, yeah, it just has a nice feel to it. Anyway, because the default is two millimeters a block, and that's a bit clunky, but uh, it's important for some of the small detail stuff. Otherwise, it'll break off. Um, anyway, this is the new half of the teapot. So I had printed the uh, the old half of the teapot earlier. And now they're a, a match set, as it were. Um, so I can put those together and get a whole teapot. And, uh, and then open it up and show there's a whole museum of the stuff inside. The MOTS Museum of the Stuff. So there's all kinds of little blocks in there and whatnot. So next, and I guess last, is uh, my X the Unknown area. Which again, I printed the other half so I get this cutaway. So there's a little portal on top that I use to uh, get to places. Uh, there's this uh, water ladder. It's uh, kind of a cool feature in the real world. The, uh, you're actually pushed up the water ladder um, by just standing there. The water actually pushes you up the, uh, up the slope. Um, a part of that broke off and they didn't notice that it had broken off, but whatever. And uh, anyway, and so now it opens up, it's cut away, and you can see the inside of the tower and uh, see both sides of it. And uh, so again, probably won't come out in the video, but there's some cool circuitry down here. It's actually printed out pretty well, like uh, there's repeaters and uh, all kinds of, you know, just wiring and so on for, um, for this uh, uh, piece that basically uh, accelerates you and sends you to the top of the tower. So that's about it. Just thought I'd show those off. Thanks. Bye.